With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, so question is all x satisfying the inequality cot inverse x whole square minus 7 into cot inverse of x plus 10 is strictly pushed. So we have to find the solution for this given inequality. So inequality is given as cot inverse of x whole square minus 7 times of cot inverse of x plus 10 is strictly positive. So we will factorize this inequality. So we can write it as cot inverse of x whole square minus 5 cot inverse of x minus 2 cot inverse of x plus 10 is strictly positive. So from the first two terms we can take common cot inverse of x. So the remaining is cot inverse of x minus 5. So from the last two terms we can take common minus 2. So the remaining is cot inverse of x minus 5 is strictly positive. So this gives cot inverse of x minus 5 into cot inverse of x minus 2 is strictly positive. Okay. So now the product of these two terms is positive. So that means either both the term are positive and both the term are negative. So since we know that cot inverse of x lies between 0 to pi. So from here we can say that cot inverse of x minus 5 is strictly less than 0. So uh, if the first term is strictly negative, so second term is also negative because uh, uh, then only the product is positive. So from here we can say that cot inverse of x minus 2 is also strictly less than 0. So this gives cot inverse of x is strictly less than 2. And we know that the cot inverse x is a decreasing function. So this gives x is strictly greater than cot of 2. So which implies x belongs to the interval cot 2 to infinity. So therefore this is the required interval for the x that is x belongs to the open interval cot 2 to infinity. So the correct answer is option 1. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.